coming at you from Diamond Bee Farm with another project. Are you like us and have tons of flies around the barnyard? Well, we are going to make a mega fly trap, which is things that we have around, all, around here on the farm. So let's get started. So we have an empty bucket, a uh, five gallon bucket, and I'm going to get it, it's got a top to it, and um, I'm going to get it washed up. Yeah, washed up for nasty flies, but hey, things you do around the house. So, um, get it sprayed out. Also going to recycle my water to water my plants. I'm excited about this. You have officially made it to halfway through this video. If you don't mind, right now, make sure you are subscribed to our YouTube channel. This helps us out a lot because we are on a drive to get a thousand subscribers. So, if you haven't already done it, hit that subscribe um, button. And turn on that notification bell and you can also leave us a comment and tell us how we're doing how you're doing and what we could do in our next video so let us know so we got our bucket all cleaned up now we're trying to prep the lid um this was the what was in it and now then it looks like soap Put that oh. yellow thing in there. We have, I don't know what y'all use, but we use these reuse disposable fly traps where all you do is kind of add water and the flies fly in, but yet they, and when they go in to get them water, they can't fly back out. So we're going to use this, this top. This one lasts a week and ours will last a month. Yeah. So we're going to cut the Yeah, that's it. Well, that's a good time <laughs> so anyway and you can get these at any of your local hardware stores and they also come with a bag mm. of bait okay what makes that stay up Oh, when you hang it up. <laughs> All right, give me some hot glue. Okay. Don't put it on the cord. We on the cord. Okay. Brought our trusty hot glue gun. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put us a ring around here. What? Of course, we got our glue gun at the Dollar Tree and also got our um, little glue sticks at the Dollar Tree. Um, so maybe this is going to be a, a good project. Right here. Where? Like underneath mm -hmm. here, right mm -hmm. there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Anywhere else? Mm -mm. Okay, I'm gonna push that in place and kind of let that dry. Okay. 
we glued this up so that, because we're not hanging it up, we're not hanging this one up, we're, we're going to just leave it up. Um, unplug the hot Okay, so we, we glued this up, and also the hot glue wasn't sticking real well, so we took it back off, and with, just with a piece of sandpaper, we kind of roughed up the lid where we were going to, um, to put it, and the hot glue worked a lot better that way. So we glued up everything. We have what I call what comes in the fly, the fly trap right there. I call it a seasoning packet. I don't know if that's right or wrong. We have an old tomato I'm putting in there. I have some old sausage. I think I'm just going to smoosh that up and make it bigger. Put it in there. It'd be fine. Just something that's going to be stinky so that they can, so it draws the flies to them. It draws the flies to it. And my seasoning packet. Uh, Kevin, you got some soup? Oh, wait a minute. Never mind. I got it. Whoa. That already stinks. And then you put about a gallon of water in here. And I'm going to eyeball it. And it's reusable. I'm going to put the lid on. So instead of a, a fly trap that only lasts about a month, Week. Oh, a week. <laughs> I'm going to have one that lasts um, at least a month. Forever. And, and it is reusable. You think I got that on there real good? Anyway, yeah. It is reusable. So after it gets all good and the flies get all gunky in it, I'll dump it out and they'll start all over again. Hope you like today's project. Don't forget to go. Like us on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram. And most of all, subscribe and share with your friends because we're here to bring you what we do around the farm. Thanks. See you later.